All right, what's up, Title Nation? We got our board briefing Monday, February 8th. We got a warm up today, a four rounder, then we have six sets for strength, and then we have a longer uh, conditioning piece today. Okay, so our warm up four rounds 20 bird dogs, eight dive bomber push ups, 20 pike to toe touches, all right, or downward dog to toe touches. Our strength today is going to be some dumbbell curls if we got too heavy of a dumbbell to curl with one arm. We can do double arm hand on each side of the dumbbell for 15 reps, 10 goblet squats, and then 10 standing tricep extensions. Rest in 30 seconds to a minute between your sets, okay? And then here's our longer piece workout today. We've got 50 burpees, cash in or buy in, and then 16 alternating dumbbell hangs, power snatches, 50-35. 20 dumbbell thrusters on each arm and then 50 burpees cash out right um we also have another option for the workout as well um 25 burpees then three rounds of 12 alternating dumbbell hand power snatches and then 12 and 12 dumbbell thrusters with 25 burpees for the cash out so a little bit shorter all right, uh, let's go back to the warm up. We got bird dogs, so working on some core, um, some coordination as well, right? They're going to be alternating reps. Dive bomber push ups. I know not everybody's at the stage where they can do dive bomber push ups. That's fine. You'll just do a push up down to a cobra, and then you can do like a downward dog back up. So we're not pushing through that um, harder portion. But if you're like, get, if you can get one or two, go ahead and do that and then scale back accordingly after that, okay? And then pike to toe touches. We're gonna be in like a downward dog position and you're just gonna release one hand and touch your opposite foot, right? It's just some shoulder um, stabilization drills, okay? And then for a strength, we're gonna bang out 15 curls to Monday, right? And then, 10 goblet squats, and then 10 standing tricep extensions. If we don't have the headroom to do standing tricep extensions, which we all don't, we can do them seated, okay? You can get a seat with a back on it, or no back, or a bench or something, um, and then just sit on it nice and tight. Let's make sure that our core is tight through here, our rib cage is pulled down, okay? And our glutes are on. We wanna support that load that we have overhead. Like I said, the longer piece or workout today, cash in 50 burpees, um, then three rounds, right? We wanna, we wanna get through the stuff we can get through at a steady pace. So these alternating power snatches, 16 of them, um, it's, it's programmed so we could probably go unbroken. If not, maybe break it up once, all right? And then the dumbbell thrusters, we have to be smart about how we attack this. We want to finish one side before we do the other side, right? So we finish one side, and I would start with your non-dominant side first. I'd bang those out in uh, two to three sets, right? And then start on the other side. If we're like, if we're taught, if we're stopping every two or three reps, okay, let's think about the load being too heavy and scaling back a little bit, okay? Or reducing it to 12 reps on each side. All right, and then we got three rounds of that, so we're gonna go through that, and then the 50 burpees at the end for the cash out. It's time to grind, boys and girls. Um, just start moving, try not to stop. Uh, I always like to tell people, if you stop on a burpee, you're still breathing hard, it's still uncomfortable, so you might as well just keep going. It's the same pain threshold, same uncomfortableness as it is if you were to stop, so you might as well just keep going. and. Play, don't play that mental game where, oh, I got 48 reps left. Just keep grinding, keep knocking them out one at a time, all right? Um, and then the fitness portion or the fitness uh, style workout is just the reps cut down, okay? It might be suitable for some of us on a Monday morning after Super Bowl Sunday, okay? So have fun. I'm going to start the week off with a banger of a workout. Um, let's hit it hard, boys and girls.